Hello friends, welcome to another video. So it is currently Saturday night. What else would ya girl, a bikini competitor, be doing other than chilling balls and meal prepping, okay? So what this video is going to be is tomorrow I am going to a posing clinic. I touched on that in my last vlog. Um, but with that being said, I'm, I have to get up early in the morning and just like be ready to go because it's an hour away. So I already planned all my food in advance and I'm going to just throw everything together tonight. So in the morning I can just grab it. I'm telling you, this is how you stay on track. It's literally so simple, but you know, a lot of people ask questions like how do I still hit my macros when I'm like traveling, when I have a busy day, whatever. Yo, plan your shit the night before, throw it all together. In the morning, you can grab and go. Okay, that way you don't even have to think about it. You don't have to waste time in the morning, whatever. So I will be showing you the process of that. And another specific thing about this is tomorrow, Sunday, is day one of new macros for me, lower macros than I have been hitting. <laughs> and I wanted to make sure that I had the whole day figured out before I just like went in because I don't want to fuck it up, right? I've never had to hit these specific macros before in my life. So <laughs> I plan everything out and I am going to just be showing you, you know, how I make sure everything is put together. So we'll do a little montage here. We'll throw some stuff together. I'll kind of explain what I'm doing and let's get rolling. meal that I'm going to be preparing is going to take a little bit more work than what we just did. Obviously you already know, got my protein brownie batter. I'm going to put this in the fridge overnight and then we've got pita chips. So that's typically my meal number two, right? So I will eat that as meal number two and then meal number three, I'm going to put it together right now. I'll show you the finished product. <laughs> All right, yos, welcome to Sunday. I showed you my struggle packing everything into that game changer bag. I just, that's the first time I've like opened it and used it. So I think it just had to break her in, but there's a decent amount of space in there. I could fit both ice packs and that would be like two meal prep containers I could fit on top of there as well. So got the food packed, got everything ready to go. Most importantly here, I have my coffee in my Harry Potter cup. Okay, and I put my new pumpkin spice um skinny syrups in there i got i put pumpkin cheesecake and of course pumpkin creamer that's really good i'm pumped this drive is about an hour so i'm gonna turn on a podcast and candace already texted us and was like i have coffee for you guys i'm like yes because today is day one of this push and the thing is i'm not really like <laughs> scared for today i'm scared for like tomorrow and the days following that, because that is when my body's gonna run out of carbs um, from being stored. So you just gotta go into it with a mindset of I'm gonna do this shit and I'm gonna make it happen, which is never an issue for your girl, you know? But you've seen my low days, uh, just in terms of like low carb, low energy. So here we go, man. Day one, new push. <sighs> Let's make shit happen. <laughs> All right, so I have made it to the posing clinic. Finished my coffee, listened to some good podcasts, got my water, 
ready to go. And I think I'm going to head in there. I mean, I'm like really early. It's like 9.31. It doesn't start till 10, but this is how I like to operate. So I might dick around on my phone for like 10 minutes. I don't know. I'm nervy a little bit, but I'm going to head on in there and I will catch you when I catch you. All right. So just finished up the posing clinic. It was freaking amazing. It flew by. I'm still feeling good. I ate my protein brownie batter and my pita chips. I didn't end up eating my next meal yet. It's still just chilling with me. Um, I want to wait till I'm hungry. It's like a little after one right now so I'm gonna drive back home it'll be like about another hour drive I think so yeah I'll probably eat when I get home and then I am getting coffee and pedicures with Amanda if you remember um, we went hiking when I first moved here and she actually like we had the same fitness coach and it's just ridiculous that we don't see each other since we live in San Diego now she moved um, to San Diego before I did but when she was driving across the country she drove through Kansas City and that was the first time we met and it was just a real good time so I freaking love her I miss her I cannot wait to hang out with her and yeah that's the update for now all the Sunday feel good vibes ready to put my podcast on and just drive man so catch you at home Well, there was no parking down by my apartment gym. And since I looked up the hours and it said it closed at five, I figured I'd just save myself the disappointment of walking up to the door and it not opening for me. So I'm at the gym to do this cardio. I'm not hype about it, but you know what? We're gonna put the headphones in. We're gonna watch YouTube and 45 minutes is gonna freaking fly. So I will catch you after. Okay, wow. So, your girl ended up dying last night. Like, I felt so sick. Like, my digestion, again, <laughs> just so fucked up. But I don't think... I think it was just, like, a combination of, like, one, the depletion. Two, I had cold brew. And three, whenever I get, like, a blind spot and then a migraine, um, which I know I said, like, I don't usually get a migraine, but my head still just like kind of hurts. It's just not like an extreme migraine, like what you would expect, but I still just feel shitty and like everything in my body just shuts down and I'm just like screwed for the rest of the day. So that includes digestion. And I just laid, I had to lay like starfish in my bed for like a couple hours. I just laid there. I almost didn't eat my final meal. I was on the edge of like a panic attack. It was just scary. I just... I don't know. It was not a good time, but I feel like an entirely new human today. Thank God it's Monday. We're going to crush this week. We're going to crush this day. And yeah, I just realized I need to outro the video. Going to edit this. That way it's up for you tomorrow. And yeah, we have some exciting stuff this week. So just stay tuned. I've got a photo shoot planned. I'm traveling this weekend to St. Louis for Fall Fest. And yeah, so those will be up next on the vlog game. But otherwise, if you watched until now, I am taking all my good vibes. I'm sending them your way. If you could give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that bell before you leave, that would be dope. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye. Oh.